Hey everybody, this is Captain Philip with Airworthy Tours, your guide in the sky. And today we're taking a tour of Bran Castle, which is commonly known as Dracula's Castle. So let's get started. The Bran Castle was established in 1211 by the Teutonic Knights, who were a German crusader order formed in Palestine during the late 12th century. After the Third Crusade, they were recruited by the King of Hungary in order to defend the area from the nomadic Cuman tribes. Today, the castle is a national monument and landmark for the country of Romania. But the castle will always be known for the 1897 iconic vampire novel of Dracula, written by Bram Stoker. Dracula is a wealthy count with a taste for blood that lives in a castle located high above a valley perched on a rock in the Principality of Transylvania, a region of Romania. However, Stoker never visited Transylvania, or even Romania, and he depicted the imaginary Dracula's castle based upon a description of Bran Castle that was available to him in 19th century Britain. The character of Dracula was loosely inspired by a real historical figure named Vlad III, also known as Vlad Dracula, who was a 15th century Romanian prince that fought ferociously against the Ottoman Turks and anybody else who crossed him. Vlad's most infamous form of execution was by impalement on a wooden spike. Victims of this punishment ranged from Turkish prisoners of war, convicted criminals, and corrupt noblemen. In one instance, Vlad impaled over 20,000 Ottoman prisoners. Ah! These actions earned him the villainous nickname of Vlad the Impaler. Legend has it that Vlad drank the blood from his impaled victims. Despite Bran Castle being known as Dracula's castle, many historians believe that Vlad Dracula never set foot in the castle. So today, the main connection between Bran Castle and Count Vlad Dracula is, well, tourism. During the 1970s, the Communist Party of Romania saw closer relationships with the West. To accomplish this, Romania decided to put a focus on its fledgling tourism industry. Because of the location of the Bran Castle, its dramatic architecture, and the supposed connections to Vlad the Impaler and Stoker's Dracula, the Romanian government decided to market the castle as the real Dracula Castle. In the nearby town of Bran, there is a belief in the existence of evil spirits called the Strigoi. These spirits acted as normal people during the day, but at night, during their sleep, their souls left their body and haunted the village, tormenting people in their sleep until first daylight when their power to harm people faded. Thus, it was these local myths that the Dracula character and modern vampire storytelling derives from. If you made it to the end, you can tip your tour guide by hitting the like button. Also, make sure to check out some of our other haunted aerial tours here. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel to be a part of future aerial tours. Thank you for flying with Airworthy Tours, and we look forward to seeing you on our next flight.